<laughs> um, I remember it was a short trip, unfortunately, but um, you know, it's one of those things that you just never forget for your whole life. And getting a taste of it my freshman year really um, helped push me and the rest of the seniors to want to go back. Did when you your teammates play ask much? you what it's like when, when they say, "What's Omaha like?" What are you gonna tell them? Yeah, I mean, they ask about, you know, the stuff that we get and stuff like that, but um, <laughs> which is sweet, but, you know, um, I, you know, we've been there and that stuff's not important. Like, um, we just keep reminding them of that, that, you know, it's more than the stuff you get and it's more than all the attention you get, you know. You're going to get way more attention if you just put that stuff to the side and focus on, you know, winning your, you know, winning your games. What other advice do you give them just about the atmosphere and playing on that biggest stage and stuff? Um... You know, there's a lot of distractions, like I said before, like people, you know, everyone's going to want to be your friend out there and everyone's going to be asking you for autographs. So um, you kind of just got to stay within yourself and stay humble um, and really just, like I said, just play the game like you've been playing it all year. You know, early in the season, um, we maybe had like 50 people at our games when it was cold out and stuff. So um, just kind of remember that, you know, that we were at that point. You've been through easy, it. Easier said than done. So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So. You've been through a couple of draft party kind of things. What was last night like? It was really special. I mean, Brendan, he he's one of the most humble dudes ever, which I think is something that just separates him from everyone else. Um, you know, you ask him about the draft or like his, like he won the John Road yesterday, right? And like I didn't even really hear about it. You didn't hear about it from him. And it's like it wasn't even a big deal. So, you know, last night it was awesome. It was awesome for Ellis, you know. Um, to get that and really just it's cool that we're able to have that you know have all the family friends and everything to make that moment special for them. What were your first impressions? I heard a little bit from Florida folks saying he didn't look excited. Brendan. Can, can you explain to them his yeah. temperament? Yeah so that's how Brendan is about 24 7 <laughs> so that's his look if you've ever seen him on the mound or at the plate he's got that that look on his face but I asked him about it I was like you know I thought you might like crack a little smile when you got drafted or something but he was just like, we were talking and he said, um, it's that moment, you know, in your life where you know it's possible and like, especially for him, like he knows he's going high, but once it happens, it's kind of like, wow, this is actually real, you know? So um, I think that like just so many emotions hit him at once that he almost had no emotion, so. <laughs> so what were your first impressions as a freshman in, in Omaha? Did you feel like, did your upperclassmen at the, at the time tell you anything about what they've heard from older players or were you prepared at all? Yeah, so that team went in 13, um, most of those guys. So, you know, they kind of said the same thing, like don't let the stuff distract you because you get so much stuff and attention and like we got our own hotel to ourselves and stuff. So um, really just focus on playing the game, like I said before. And, uh, you know, we had some great senior leaders on that team with Jeff Gardner and uh, Cole Sturgeon. So um, they really helped lead us and, you know, keep us humble. and. Uh, ground level. What was it like when you walked out on the, that field of TD Ameritrade the first time? It was actually really cool. I'll never forget that. Um, so you get in like a little tunnel type thing um, and you're kind of just standing there in the dark with like your team and I remember Lamonis saying like like everyone was quiet and like we're about to walk out on the field and he's like let's get it going in here and then everyone like starts jumping and screaming so that was something I'll never forget um, but yeah just walking out seeing all the fans you know Get crazy. Sure I'm sorry. sorry. That's all right. Yeah, just watching the fans, you know, go crazy was just an unbelievable moment. Uh, sharing that with the team and the coaches. I haven't looked at the box, but did you play at all? Did you see any action? I did. Um, I went in uh, against Texas. Uh, pinch got one pinch hit. I think I flew out to second, and then got to play a little outfield. So that was really cool that you know Coach Mack got me uh, some experience there. How do you make sure this trip lasts longer? Yeah, um, you know, I think this team's a little different. Our team, my freshman year, definitely had some good chemistry, but this year it's just like, I think someone said it before, maybe in an interview, but it's just like we're at peace with where we're at right now, and we know who we are as a team, and we trust our ability, we trust our coaches to make the right calls, and um, just carrying that with us, that confidence and trust in each other, um, I think will take us far. One more. Did you get any weird like autograph requests or anything last time you were in Omaha or what was like the sh most surreal experience that you had? Um, I mean just like walking down the street you know not even wearing Louisville stuff like people would be like like you play baseball and you'd be like yeah and 
they're just random people, you know, and they're, they'll, like, pull anything out of their pocket to, like, sign. It's, like, yeah, like, anything. I don't know, a piece of paper, like, a gift card or something, like. So, you know, it's just cool that that town really, you know, takes us in as their own, kind of, when we get there. Everybody good? Thanks. Thanks. Cool. Thanks. Thank you.